Okay, can we just go ahead? Meanwhile, Midjor was coaching an insecure Bono. What's that? Clanging chimes of doom, yeah. Uh, the clanging chimes of doom. He actually holds back. Clanging back-up. chimes of doom. Yeah, if you can get that, it'd be great. And then just go for that last line. It sounds great when you build it okay. out. And the Christmas bells that ring there are the clanging chimes of doom. Well, tonight, thank God it's them instead of you. And is that the chimes of doom I pulled off? The voice that 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 surprised me was Bono, really, because I, 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 you two were not the huge supergroup at that particular moment that they are now or became after Live Aid. That great shout of Bono's, you know, um, which he argued with me about that line. He didn't want to do that line. I'm here with all these people. I don't know. I just know Bob. He pass gives me a uh, the lyrics. I read the lyric and I say, I will, I'll sing any line except that one. He says, that is the lyric I've been keeping for you. And he said, are you sure you want to do that? You want to say that? And I said, yes, I do want to say that. I said, there's no way I'm not singing it. Tonight, thank God, it, it, it's them instead of you. I said, I can't sing it. I don't, I just can't sing that line. He said, you have to, because that's the one that's going to hurt the most. I said, can you imagine your family living through this? Can you imagine it? And I said, that's what this is about. We're having Christmas. It's fantastic. It's cozy. It's warm. We're giving each other this stuff. Outside that cozy window, there's a completely different real world. We had so many rows about religion, you can't imagine how many rows we've had about God. And so I walked in and I says, well, Bob, you've written your first hymn then, haven't you? Fuck off. We'll just run it down again. Where the only water flowing is the bitter sting of tears. And when he sang it, he nailed exactly, you know, that, that frustration and anger in me that I wrote that line. I still don't like the way it sounds. Uh, I still, it sounds, it's so sort of um, big, you know. It's a little, little, it's a little voice trying to be a big one. It's, uh, and and it's, a, and it's a little man carrying a very big idea. And uh, I, I don't think I pull it off at all, no. 